Bro, I know that feeling, bro. You just relapsed. You're watching this video, bro. It's okay. I'm here to tell you it's okay. But I don't want you relapsing again. And I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm probably gonna relapse again eventually, right? But yo, my goal every single day is to get 1% better every single day. One more day, get better. One more day, get better. And I want you to understand, I don't want you relapsing again. So remember the first thing you should always remember, why the hell are you doing this? Why the hell are you on no fat? Why the hell are you on retention? Why? Because you want a better version of yourself. You want to become the best. You don't want to be the same Jeffrey who's always stroking his turkey, stroking his meat, who's always killing himself. Don't do that, bro. I want you to become the best possible version. And most, some of the most successful men are on no fat, right? And when you can hold all your seeds, bro, you get more testosterone. That's when you get that. That's when you become that top dude. That's when you become masculine, right? And just think about it. You know how many dudes are fat right now? You know how many dudes? For you to be like, no, I can't do this. Bro, you're literally better than everyone else. It's us against every single person who be fabbing, bro. It's us against the world, bro. Just remember that, bro. And every single day, yo, you gotta fight that. Get 1% better every single day. One more, one more, one more, one more. Now I want you to understand, what are the patterns? What are the actions? For me, when I relapse, bro, this is what happens, bro. It's literally, it's the same thing every single time, bro. It's I'm up. Late as hell at 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, right? And I had mad energy. I'm trying to figure out how can I go to sleep? How can I go to sleep? I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. And then what happens? Next thing you know, I'm on my phone late at night. And then you just see a boom. Fuck. And then I'm watching a video, what to do when you relapse. See, that's the pattern. So what do you have to do? You have to switch up. Because doing the same thing over and over again, expect a different result is insanity. So I know one thing. I like to work out at night, right? But if I take pre-workout at night, I will be up all night. So sometimes... If I'm not dead tired, if I'm dead tired, if so sometimes if I have mad energy, I won't take pre-workout because I know I'm going to be up. Or I just work out without pre-workout and I'll fall asleep right away. Or I try to go to sleep right away. I won't be up for too much long. Or sometimes even if I do take pre-workout and I'm up, I'll start just reading anime mangas because I know once I start reading and I'm in bed, I'm going to just end up knocking out. So you have to first understand your problems and make sure you remember your why. Another thing that I see that happens a lot when you just relapse it is another thing. When I'm in the crib just chilling, that's why I end up relapsing. I know I'm about to relapse, but I just get out of the house. I'm like, ooh, I just got to leave quick as hell, right? So remember that. When you're active and you're always busy you're doing stuff, you're least likely to relapse. Because if you're relapsing, you're probably in the crib playing 2K. You're probably in the crib just chilling. You're probably watching some movies. You're probably scrolling on Instagram. You might have to unfollow them shorties, bro. I know you don't want to unfollow them, but you might have to unfollow them shorties. It's hard not to relapse when you have half naked shorties on your timeline flat out, okay? See? Unfollow all of them. Stop. Delete the porn sites. Delete all those stuff, right? I don't want you relapsing again, okay? So first thing is understand the patterns. And then number two is staying busy, staying active, getting yourself extremely tired. Always be working out. You guys know I'm always preaching. Always be working out. Or even put that energy into your purpose. Like, I know staying in the crib is how I end up relapsing. So what I do, I'm going to take my laptop. I'm going to go to Starbucks and I'm going to start editing some videos, start working on my crafts, start editing my books, start doing something to make sure I don't ever relapse again, right? Remember, this is your chance to get better. I want you to become 1% better every single day. And another tip is, bro, do you have any dates this week? Are you linking up with any shorties? If you're not linking up with any shorties, you have no dates, it's hard not to relapse. Bro, get on the apps, swipe on the apps, try and set up some dates. If you can't get no dates in the app, go out. Go to the street, go approach some girls, go to your major city, go to your Whole Foods, go to your Targets, go somewhere. Just get the hell out the house and go say hi to a girl, bro. I know when you're on NoFap, you know that energy. You know that social energy you have. Go talk to a shorty. Stop being scared. Do it, bro. Because I would say that one approach is getting 1% better. And then from there, do one more. Then again, do one more. Then again, do one more till you get better, bro. Because I'm going to tell you right now. Jeffrey, he's not doing that. He's not getting better. Those beta cucks, they're not getting better. They're just stroking a turkey. And just imagine yourself, sit back and imagine yourself. Sit back, just look at it, look at yourself. Just imagine yourself on the phone, stroke from the third person for you, stroke on your phone like this. Fucking pussy ass motherfucker. Why the hell are you stroking it, bro? 
Just imagine so, when you can go out and say hi, when you can get a date, you have Instagram, you have Hinge, you have Tinder. Guys ask me how to DM girls on TikTok. And you literally can go out the house and meet girls. You have bars and nightclubs. You have Whole Foods. You have Target. You have libraries. You tell them, and there's more women in this world than men. And majority of women are single. So I don't care what nobody says. They say dating apps are dead. They say code approach is dead. Something has to work. I just need like 10 different ways. They have Facebook apps, bro. Show these ladies sliding my dance on YouTube, bro. You literally can meet girls anywhere. There's no reason why you should be relapsing. There's no reason why you should be making an excuse. Just try and set up a date, bro. Even if show is not interested in you, bro, you take on the small ice cream dates, bro. Eventually, when you start getting more energy, when you start getting more female energy in your life, you're, you're going to be least likely to relapse, bro. Now, I want you, I told you how to relapse without the female energy. Now, I'm telling you what the female energy. And the next thing, always try to keep a girl in your mind, bro. Never cut off your, I mean, you can cut off your shoulder, but you do it's harder. But just remember, the longer you go, the easier it gets. The hardest part is like the first week. Like the second week's a little harder, but by the time you get to like week three, it gets a little bit easier, bro. So, but yo guys, you like this kind of concept, check out this video right here.